Crossbarrow 12 2. Play money, backdrop, nothing compares. Again, that uh, good backdrop sow that has uh, done good and just a couple litters here. And uh, again, we talked those gilts earlier. There was two or three of those that we thought were very, very high quality. And uh, this barrel probably is in the mix for sure to, to look and discuss of which one you might like best within the litter. But uh, definitely a highlight here uh, in our barrel offering. Yeah, and I mean, uh, you talk about one that can get even a cattle guy excited about hair. This is one shaggy, shaggy rascal. But yet he's still so neat looking. He's really tall and elevated there. He's neat about his skull and his head there. But that thing's got quite a bit of muscle shape in him. Take that one home. Feed that one. I think that barrow could be really, really good come um, the end, whatever end point, honestly, you choose. I think he's got a big feeding window. Yeah, it needs to be on the short list of, of those top-end, high-caliber barrows, I think. Uh, that's where this one sets. He's He's got that uh, futuristic look about him, but uh, does so with some shape, uh, but not too much at this stage of the game. Everything just proportions and balances right. Uh, hind leg works the way it's supposed to. Uh, very, very excited about uh, what this thing can do. Again, if you're serious about trying to win a, a market hog show, uh, this is one you need to have on the short list, 12-2.